amidst the economy downturn, there are still opportunities for professionals to earn income, especially in the tourist resort island. But producers may need to enhance or improve their skills to add value to their products, like this embroidery work on ordinary sarongs. Different colours of tiny beads are being put on along the pattern of local sarong dresses called pâté by a group of women who have been trained for some time. Today, the ordinary sarong, widely worn in southern Thailand, is listed in upmarket fashion houses and not surprisingly, is famous among both Thais and foreign clients. The document certifies its industrial standard and assures clients of the group's product quality. Each bead and color is carefully and neatly selected to suit the color and pattern of the material to ensure that they boost elegancy and preference of clients, Thais and foreigners. The group learnt that Thais are fond of simple styles and colors of the sarong, while tourists like Russians and Indians prefer bright and colorful beads. These products under the Lukput Wunjai, literally meaning United Beads Work Group, are a result of a get-together from Muslim women of Rawai village in the south of Phuket Island. They started off learning and hand-making the bead embroidery sarong in their spare time. While Ta Tong Nam, a member of the bead embroideries on sarong in Rawai, said now it becomes their regular monthly income in addition to their day-to-day -day jobs as it can add value. The cost of material may be just over 100 baht and a bit more for the beads but they can sell the completed article at almost 3,000 baht per piece. <laughs>